Hello and welcome to the video for what is flow control the branch node. I've created a quick example here using the branch. If we click blue, it prints out it's blue. If we click red, it prints out it's red. The branch is basically a way of determining what to do if something is true or false and then executing the appropriate actions. For my example here, when we click blue, we set a variable called it's blue to true. If we click red, we set a variable called it's red to true. The actual branch statements are here in this little function, and here's how they work. You can create one by right clicking and typing branch. You can right click and create one by typing if, or you can simply click in your graph and hit the B key and click, and it will create a branch node as well. So the branch node takes in a bool variable and outputs a true or false execute wire. In this example, we check and see is red set to true. If it is, the true wires execute. We print out text and set our variable back to false. If it is not true, well then our false will fire and we go and we check and see is blue true. Well, if it is, we print out the same thing except it says it's blue and we set the blue to false. Now if blue is not false and is not true as well, then the false fires and we print out it's nothing. Since I'm setting either red or blue to true, one of these two will always fire. But this is a way to basically, if something happens, do it. If not, do it. If not, well here's your fail safe back to an event because the false will fire off. And that's it. That's all there is to a branch. It's a useful node for tracking if something is true or false and executing based on that.